think it's, we've been lucky. We haven't had rain. I think the last two days of the stages have dried up very well. So I think it'll be a nice, exciting race. And I think we'll, we'll put some good times. Good morning. Uh, well, eh? Um, very excited. Can't wait for the rally to start now. Yeah, the car I've been driving is the new R4, which is uh, we're one class lower than the R5s. Um, it's got slightly less horsepower. It's a standard engine, but it's still a 1600 turbocharged engine. Um, it is supposed to be slower to, than the R5s, but um, we're going to try and give them a good go today. Uh, we're not really bothered with uh, what they want to do. We're going to focus on a rally and go at our pace and see how, how, how we end up at the end of the day. Flat out, eh? <laughs> we have to attack. You, you know, you, you set the trend from the first stage. Um, in Zambia, usually our first stage is a power stage, so you get three points for winning that. So it's a good thing to get yourself set up for the rest of the stage because, you know, everyone will be a bit slow on the first runs and everyone goes quicker. So you need to be quick on the first stage and then hopefully that will set a trend um, and then you manage the rest of the race as the day goes by. After shakedown, Jana, there was any technical faults that we recognize this morning? It was a bit slippery to the spin off, but uh, you only just, we have to be careful. What we call trees, it's still wet. There's been a lot of rain in the past few days. Yeah, the problem is, is I, I only got to drive the car yesterday, so we. Um, on shakedown. I did drive it five or six times in the shakedown, so I'm quite happy, but I'll probably get better and better towards the end. So um, we'll do the first stage and see where we are, and then we'll plan the next strategy after that. Every rally for me is, is you, you come out to have fun. You know, the results will come if you're having fun. If you put yourself in under pressure, then you mess up. So look, you know what, it's, it's great having Manvea in front. You know, we're chasing, um, chasing after him. Having the R4, knowing that he drives very quick in these stages, you know, it makes you a little bit sharp and say, look, you don't want to get caught because no driver wants to get caught in a stage. So we'll keep us sharp, but like I said, you know, we've got a good car. It's well set up. We just have to drive and trust our notes, and I think our notes are looking very good. Well, uh, this event is uh, one of the longest events in the calendar for us. Um, so it's not really a sprint race, it's an uh, endurance race almost. Um, so, you know, most definitely, you know, the first couple stages, you need to ease ourselves into the rally a little bit and make sure we don't make any mistakes so uh, well, I think our strategy will be um, just to build our pace and uh, after every stage maybe go a little bit quicker a little bit quicker but um, in saying that the roads look really good they've spent a lot of time on the roads the roads have been graded and they look very fast so uh, you know there's going to be a lot of commitment out there from the driver and the navigator. Oh, I'm doing well beautiful weather woke up this morning to a nice view so we're very happy that it didn't rain too much overnight the stages will be great today. Yes, we are. We don't like these long holding areas where we have to wait for an, about an hour. It uh, runs the butterflies up too much in the stomach, but yes, we're ready. You know, we've got some guys from Africa. We've got uh, Leroy Gomes in his brand new R5 and Manvia in his R5. Um, so those cars are going to be up front, most certainly uh, setting the pace. And then also we've got the brand new R4, which uh, got flown in from Orica from France and Hachen's driving the R4. Um, I had the pleasure of driving it yesterday in Shakedown, uh, fantastic motor car, uh, really, really good to drive. So uh, Hachen knows these roads very well and um, you know he's one of the top drivers in South Africa. So I'm pretty sure he's going to give the R5s a run for the money. So um, yeah, we'll see. It's going to be an interesting event. Mwanzo. Satlist ya kwanza ni kwa wanne hivyo mbadilisha kidogo strategy mwanzo ilikuwa nataka kwenda push from stage 1 sasa hivi niko chini barabara ndagaya namna barabara ile hivi tukavuanza namna gani sema mazo nzuri we push to the maximum na mtumeza kusikiliza madereva kile ambacho mmeza kuzungumza na kwenye opening ceremony pale na hapa tuko katika stage 1 stage ya kilometer 16 magari yatakuja yatapanga hapa yataanza stage hiyo sasa mimi nataka kuongea zaidi it's all time naam karibu katika Sabina in stage 1 ambayo tunaweza kuona hapo Skoda Fabia R5 ikiwa na Manvir Bariani akiwa na Drew Star kwa kiwa wameingia ndani stage hiyo na kama tulivyoweza kuwasikia wakizungumzia uh, kile kilichotokea katika katika shakedown na performance ya gari yake anavyoiona na sasa tuone nini ambacho kitatokea uh, katika stage ambazo uh, zitachezwa kwa siku uh, hii leo tutakuwa na stage 7 kwa hiyo uh, shughuli itakuwa nzito nipo na David Matete uh, pamoja tunaweza kuangalia R5 tunaanza kuiona live sasa hapa tume 
tumezoea wenge wajaiona na kisasa tunaangalia moja kwa moja kutokea hapa sana yes yes ni kweli tunaangalia moja kwa moja kutokea hapa mpuma langa na tuko live kweli kweli na jinsi tunavyoona kwa mara kwanza kabisa Uh, gari ambayo inazinduliwa hapa ingawa haijatengenezwa hapa lakini ni kwamba hii gari itakuja ku itafanywa hapa kila kitu hapa uh, inaitwa Toyota Terios eh Toyota Terios Etios Etios ah uh, yeah, yeah. ili ni wanasema ni in R4 kit kwa hiyo uh, ni tutaona tereni yake ni tutaona performance yake itakuwaje na itakuwa burudani kwa kweli maana Manville yuko hapa Leroy Gomes yuko hapa Guy Botelli yuko hapa na Champion wa hapa pia Feken yuko hapa basi Apo. itakuwa burudani zaidi Ismail Sheikh Mohamed yuko hapo Uh, kwa ni, ni, ni burudani tu tunaweza tukaangalia hizo ni VW Polo uh, zikiwa nyingi za kutosha nime, 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 kwa kweli nimeona uh, VW hizo uh, Polo zikiwa za kutosha kabisa kwenye R2 yes kuna R2 nyingi sana hapa na zinawapa zinawapa ile motivation kwa wao kwa wao kufanya vizuri kwa sababu ndio ni, ni, ni gari ambazo ziko cheap ku, ku, kuziafford na cheap pia kuzimaintain na inakuwa rahisi pia kwa, kwa, kwa kushindana kwa hiyo ni ni advantage nzuri sana na tunaweza kuona wana enjoy wenyewe kwa sababu uh, hii ndio 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 circuit yao ndio mipango yao ambayo inaendelea stage ya kilomita sita ambapo tunaweza tukashuhudia magari yakiwa ya yanaondoka huyo ya ni gari nambari 4 ikiwa inaendeshwa na dereva anaitwa Cortez uh, kutoka Rally Technic yeah yeah uh, Rally Technic director uh, mwenyewe director bosi mwenyewe anaendesha <laughs> ni Mazda kwa na nafikiri ni inauti pia nzuri kwa sababu mwaka jana ilipata shida kidogo iliungua kabisa yani walikuwa wanazindua ikaja ikashika moto kabisa ikaisha lakini no, no, this time around wamejipanga na wanafanya vizuri acha tuone tuone time zake zitakuwaje kiukweli kuna gari nyingi kuna R2 nyingi kuna Polo nyingi uh, vilabi wanafanya vizuri sana hapa Uki, ukijaribu kusikia milio uh, ya, 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 ya hizo gari uh, kama hizo VW kuiona power yake ilivyo haina take off haina take off ni, ni, ni nyuki eh, lakini ukishaweka moja ukiweka ya pili unaweza ukaikuta iko mbele uka. kabisa ukishapata pick uh, yes kama tunamuona hapa ni champion huyu wa mwaka jana mm. uh, guy bottle uh, eh, anaenda vizuri kabisa akiwa na R2 uh, gari ambayo ina spec ndogo lakini nafikiri atapata competition kubwa sana kutoka kwa former championship kwa hapa na pia uh, kutoka kwa Manville Bariani pamoja na Leroy Gomes we champion unaangaliaje hii competition uh, ukijaribu kuona muziki uko pale mbele na hasa kuwepo uh, kwa hii gari mpya uh, R4 uh, Toyota Etios lakini unaweza kuona kuna R5 ziko mbili uh, kuna, kuna, kuna kama kuna kama beto hivi R5 na R4 yes yes ni kweli kabisa kuna kama beto kubwa kabisa ambayo inaendelea hapa ambayo itaendelea hapa na tutaona katika hii day 1 na day 2 pia lakini uh, kwa haraka haraka tu performance ni nzuri sana lakini uh, R5 wana advantage kubwa sana katika stage hizi uh, lakini pia tusisahau pia uzoefu wa Feken katika katika barabara hizi ameshafanya uh, rally zaidi ya kadhaa zaidi ya miaka 20 kwa hiyo uh, wana uwezo mkubwa sana na bila shaka ataleta competition kubwa lakini uh, outing ya kwanza kabisa kwa Leroy Gomes kwa hiyo uh, tunategemea anaweza akafanya vizuri pia. Leroy Gomes akiwa ametoka akiwa na R5 Ford Fiesta ndio tunaweza kuiona imecheza rally tatu pale nyumbani uh, kama si rally mbili. Yes, rally mbili. Rally, rally, rally mbili sasa imetoka uh, inacheza rally ya tatu nje ya ya, ya uwanja wa, wa Zambia kwa maana ya kwamba Andola pamoja na Pio Lusaka ambapo ndipo uh, mashindano mengi wa Uh, ya kifanyika. Ah uh, tunaweza kuona hiyo Subaru. Uh, yani Subaru zilikuwa mbili tu. Yes, Subaru zilikuwa <laughs> mbili tu. Kwa kweli kabisa uh, wana wana wanapambana. Wana eh uh, Subaru N10, N10 N12. Nafikiri ni N10. Ni Subaru N10. N10, yeah. N10. Wa, kwa hiyo tunaweza kuona ziko mbili kabisa na wanaenda vizuri lakini competition kubwa sana hapa ni kwa R2 boys hawa kwa kweli tunamuona hapo uh, Ismail Shem Mohamed ameshaanza achukua turn hiyo anakamata hiyo fat anaendelea kwa kweli ni yupo vizuri na hata nimeona setup ya gari yake pia uh, na hata tutasikia uh, conversation zake za mwanzo katika interview anasema kwamba uh, yupo tayari na atapush hiyo ni gari kiendeshwa na mwanadada 
uh, ambaye anajulikana kwa jina la Luna uh, Luna Simon uh, ni, 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 ni kati ya madereva na manivigeta wanawake lakini yeye sasa anaendesha yeye ni driver uh, yeye ni driver na uh, kama unaweza kufuatilia vizuri kwenye shutdown ile umemsikia alichokuzungumza amefanya uh, test ya kutosha yuko tayari kwa ajili ya competition tuangalie nini ambacho kitatokea katika stage uh, zote za siku hii leo kuona eh advantage yeah. ya kigali kidogo dogo na tani kama hizo anachukua kwa kweli competition ni ngumu kwa hiyo inabidi apush kwa kweli kwa nyuma kuna watu karibia watatu wenye nguvu kabisa ah kimo inabidi aweke chini kwa sababu kufanya mchezo hiyo 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 uh, Ford Fiesta hapo iko nyuma kwa nyuma anaweza uh, kamchukua uh, yeah. na kikubwa ninavyoona ni roho anakuja kwa one mission tu na unaweza kusikia yes 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 tumeona kabisa amekuja kwa one mission na ana anahakika atafanya vizuri kutokana na na, na situation ya kwenda lakini mpaka uh, sasa unaweza kuona uh, fight ipo close kabisa na na bado ni open na bado ni open rally unaweza kuona feken champion wa 2008 2009 South Africa hapa uh, akiwa katika stage hiyo kwa mara kwanza na hiyo gari uh, Toyota Etios R4 eh unaona <laughs> e, gari inavyozunguka inavyogeuka kama vile unacheza PlayStation yes gari imefungwa kwa kweli unaweza kuona wasema unaweza kuona gari nzuri lakini je anaendesha yeah, kuna tofauti mkubwa sana mkubwa kati ya yeah. gari na dereva vile vile mm, unaisukumaje gari unaipa una push to the maximum to the mpaka vile inafika au inakuwaje kwa hiyo kuna tofauti mkubwa na na, na hiyo itajidhihirisha leo hapa tuone uh, how things works katika uh, madriver ambazo tunao hapa kwa ajili ya ARC na bado pia kuna competition ya locals hapa ambao wanatumia R2 sana na pia kuna uh, group nyingine kabisa ambayo itakuwa ni ya class cars unaweza kumuona Portgiata aki 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 akikanyaga hiyo hiyo VW uh, R2 Hizi sasa ni betu sasa za R2 zimeanza. Unaweza kuona beto yake jinsi uh, ilivyo ya, ya VW zimejipanga hapo. Uh, yes, Corolla hizo uh, Team Shield hiyo. Anaitwa George yule, ana ana ana, ana Corolla. Competition competition ni kama unavyoweza kuiona tunajaribu kuona kwanza uh, katika stage hii ya kwanza uh, nini ambacho nani anaweza kutoka cheza vizuri kabisa yes amechukua uh, kona vizuri team technic yeah mzee Chris Quates mm. mm. vizuri vizuri anajaribu kufanya vile vitu ambavyo vinatakiwa ambao naipata hapa ni kubwa kabisa yani uh, the way kinavyo 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 kinavolia eh? ile sound unavoisikia kwa kweli uh, ni burudani tosha kabisa unasikia kiara tu kimeshikiliwa ni kwamba uh, kipo familia katika hizi stage kwa hiyo uh, driver naona wana enjoy wana push kwa kutokana na ile uh, level yake kabisa kwa hiyo na uh, championship kwa tamu na wakati unaweza kuona unasikia baba kama kuna gari mbili zinakuja kumbe kumbe ni gari moja tu. Yes. Yeah, Botorel huyo anaweza kumuona uh, kutoka katika nafasi uh, karibu nafasi ya saba ya nane uh, katika 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 start list hiyo. Yes, yes. Uh, lakini ndoka champion lakini amekubali kukaa nyuma nyuma kutokana na uwezo wa gari. Yeah, na uwezo wa gari afu kuna factor nyingi. Uh, lazima lazima upishe kwanza hizi uh, all wheel all wheel cars labda kuna Skoda, kuna 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 na tayari kashacha kio tayari shukrani mkutano ameona kwa kupata moment ya mkutano na mti hapo katikati kwa lazima upishe gari kwanza uh, gari ambazo zina 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 nani kubwa uh, 1.6 all we drive skoda etios pamoja na 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 na, na, na fiesta alafu baadaye sasa tunakuja tunakuja wengine hapo nyuma tunaangalia wengine nyuma hapo ana tu nani wote ambao mtakuwa in the mix ilikuwa ime 
imebadilika kidogo lakini naona sasa hivi imesha balance na hata uh, drivers wanapata hiyo uh, ni kabisa subali ya kwanza kabisa na hapa tuna subali mbili and ten mbili uh, tuna subali mbili tu mm. tunaweza tukaziona jinsi uh, zinavyofunguka kabisa kabisa kama huyo tunamwona Roy Holland akiwa na Robbie Coase wanaenda vizuri kama subali and ten Mhm. Ya resio. Gari kipo. Inaweza, inaweza. Nafikiri tu ni ni, ni driver mwenyewe anakuwa makini zaidi kuhakikisha kwamba afanye mistake na anaenda fast zaidi. Lakini uh, as far as tunaweza kuona katika rally iliyopita alipata stage mbili alichukua na ameanza ku catch up. Unajua hii ameshapinduka nayo mara mbili. Yes. Na baada ya kumkana mara mbili kidogo imempa uoga. Mm. Kwa amevoanza msimu ameanza ku catch up. Gari huwa inamsumbuaga katika katika day 1 lakini day 2 anajitahidi kuja ku cover. Anamaliza ana, ana kwa yes. Ameanza kurudisha ile confidence. tutaona time zitakapokuwa ta compare na time ambazo uh, zime uh, umezitumia kwa stage hiyo ya kwanza ambapo tunaweza tukaona uh, fake ame amechukua hiyo stage yes naona fake ni amechukua ametumia uh, dakika 11 na sekunde 34 kwa kweli amenishangaza ame kidogo naona performance ni nzuri ameanza vizuri kabisa dakika 11 na sekunde 34 lakini Uh, akifatiwa na Manvili Bariani yeye yeah, ametumia dakika moja na sekunde hamsina moja kwa hiyo unaweza kuona <laughs> eh, sasa tayari mtu anaongoza kwa sekunde alafu unakwenda kwa stage ile ile mm. unakwenda kuonyesha kile ambacho uh, kimekuita pale kabisa naona arafo hizi gari bwana jinsi zinavyoondoka unaweza kuona kama vile umesimizi unaweza kuona unafunjiwa malizi hii unaweza kuona eh R2 hizo kwa hiyo unaweza kuona itafika kweli itapiga hizi time kweli lakini ngoja ishike zee technica his quotes ana push kweli kweli ana naye anajaribu ku stress naona anajaribu kumsukuma guy bottle ilikuwa na jinsi gani itakuwa shushe mzigo yes yes badilisha engine na changamoto fulani kwa kweli lakini na hata mwenyewe anakubali kabisa kwa bwana kuna top cars siwezi kuzibiti lakini i try aone jinsi gani ata 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 ata, ata, ata push eh? kwa hiyo ni hiyo ipo wazi kwamba gari anatumia ni low spec ara two cars uweze ku match up na zile hizo uh, top cars ara five pamoja na uh, 
etios ambayo inakuwa ina R4 kit watu wako kazini nimesema competition yeah. inazidi kuwa ni changamoto gari zinazidi eh hey, hey. una polo hiyo imepata moments kidogo <laughs> eh ametembea tairi mbili kidogo amechukua amechukulia ndani zaidi yeah yeah amechukulia ndani naona kuna kuna kama ki deep plan kwa hiyo ime almost ame flip lakini ame save unaweza kuona hiyo advantage ya kuwa ilikuwa inamchukua ile eh ukiwa fundi haya mambo yanafanya doji ya peke yake mcheza nao unatembea nao na tairi mbili baadhi mpresa hiyo ametupa vizuri kabisa ametupa vumbi nasema cheza vizuri kabisa hapa Ismail gari na inavuta eh ona gari kidogo ina hapa amna ni all we drive on drive eh all we drive naona amepata moments kidogo ya kuja maximum au vipi au labda kuna issue setting lakini anyway eh wakati unajaribu kufikiria push zaidi basi naona kwamba hapa sasa ni muda wa kukanyaga na kanyaga ya unabandika sasa unaweza pakawa terrain na kuruhusu ubandike kwa hiyo unapata vitu mbalimbali ya tatu akiwa na igari lakini unaona akiwa na mke wake pembeni pale ya ushila kama unekani vile hivi sasa unataka kitabu tumbele hata juu kwa unaweza kuona R4 ikijaribu kutengeneza Pesi yani unajua hapa kinachotaka kuonekana ni kwamba R4 is better than R5. Yes, hicho ndio kikubwa ambacho kinajaribu kuonekana hapa kwa sababu mpaka hii gari imeletwa hapa kwa sababu kuna rally technical wanataka kutengeneza R4 kit hapa ina maana anachukua shell katika manufacturer mwingine alafu anakuja wanaweka kit ya Oreca. Kwa hiyo kusudi gari ionekane na perform kusudi gari yuzike inabidi ionekane na perform kwa hiyo ndio hicho ndio maana amekodisha huyu driver uh, professional kabisa alishaikuepo kwenye timu ya VW washakuepo kwenye timu ya uh, uh, Ford South Africa kashaikuwa bingwa mara mbili mfululizo pale South Africa akiwa na manufacturer team kwa hiyo unaweza kuona jinsi gani mtu amepewa mtu sahihi kusudi kuonyesha Uh, uwezo wa gari uwezo wa gari na kwa nini hii gari inatakiwa ije Afrika na kwa nini, nini izalishwe itengenezewe hapa itengenezewe hapa kuna mara kwa tereni hapa na ina speed na unaweza kushindana na mtu mwingine yeyote kama Manville au Leroy Gomes au Guy Bote kwa hiyo ni gari ambayo ni ya budget nafuu kutokana kulingana na zile alafa <laughs> Taita mwenyewe Oreca. Yes, yes, yes. Ana mzee technic mwenyewe Chris Quetz. Yeye ni push so kama so kama anataka tu kutengeneza lakini na yeye mwenyewe ana enjoy, anapenda anachokifanya. Anapenda anachokifanya. Anapenda rally. Kwa hiyo ni kitu kizuri ambacho kinamtoa kila mtu furaha kwamba okay nao sasa hivi tunaanza kutengeneza gari zetu sasa hivi tunaweza kuwa na performance wenyewe na tunaweza kufanya vitu vikubwa mbalimbali kutokana na, na, na vitu vya pressure kweli kweli kwa sababu ana pressure ya watu wa mbele na ana 
maisha ya watu wa nyuma pia kina mzee Chris lakini mbele pia kubuka mbele mbele kuna Liloi Gomes ya moments hiyo hiyo alatu umeona amepata moments kidogo alafu kuna miti kwa hiyo sasa eh changamoto yake ni kubwa sana acha kio mapema kabisa kwenye section ya kwanza nafikiri ya acha acha kuendeleka time uh, unaweza kumuona guy bottle ameshapanda juu hapo amefika nafasi ya ngapi uh, yuko kwenye nafasi ya nne na maana baada baada ya Freken uh, Marvin Roy alafu anakuja yeye anafuata yeye ina maana yeye ndo akaa namba moja katika uh, katika gari hizi za R2 si ndio ndio maana yake yeah katika kategori yake ina maana yeye mpaka sasa hivi ndo anaongoza which is kwa sababu ya uwezo wake unaweza kuona kabisa uh, gari bottle yupo vizuri na bado uh, gari inamruhusu kufanya vitu mbalimbali kutokana si smile ana push gari ana push kwa kweli ana push na mwenyewe uh, ukimuuliza na kuambia bado endelea kujifunza. Ya, mwaka ni kufunza. Competition ni ngumu sana hapa sasa so, Afrika kwa hiyo lazima apushi kusudi la sivyo VR2 vitakupiga na yeye kidogo ana gari yenye spec ya juu na stufao wengi hiyo. Kwa hiyo tunaona mwanadada huyo Lun Simon akiwa na Rickus Fori wakiwa na Subaru yuko Ya yeah, napambana na anaenda vizuri kwa gari na kwa kategori yake uh, ingawa naona VR2 vina vina mwokota shuli <laughs> shuli <laughs> eh inabidi akaze inabidi akaze kuhakikisha kwamba uh, ana maintain au anaipa heshima yake Subaru maana otherwise basi itakuwa uh, changamoto ni ni tunaangalia ARC uh, na hii ni ARC2 Uh, tunaita South African Rally au Rally of South Africa uh, Lok Rally inafanyika huku uh, kwenye mji wa wa wa, wa Sabi uh, mpuma langu huko nje ya mji kabisa uh, sehemu ambayo kwa kweli unaweza ukashangani miti tu kama vile huko mafinga vile kabisa ile eneo ni remote area kama unaweza kuona hapo Uh, kuna spectators I mean spectators wapo lakini kwenye sehemu maalum ambayo itakuwa ni spectator stage lakini huku uh, kwa kweli eneo unaona kabisa spectator wamekaa nje ya tape kama unaweza kuona na wa, 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 wanaangalia rally wana enjoy wako salama kabisa na ni eneo ambalo unaweza kuona amna amna mwingiliano wa barabara zingine kwa hiyo unaweza ni eneo salama kabisa kwa ajili ya rally na hii ndio modern rally ambazo zinakuwa zinafanyika Uh, watu wanakuwa na enjoy kuna kwa kuna usalama mkubwa sana katika kushindana kwa kweli kwenye swala la usalama uh, wamezingatia sana na kumbuka kwamba uh, delegates ya FIA si mkubwa wako hapa uh, nimeona kina kuna jeroni kwa ni ni event ambayo kwa kweli ni ushindani mkubwa Tunaanza moja racing show baada ya section mbili ambazo zimepigwa uh, kwa asubuhi hii. Yaani kwa maana kwamba imepigwa section ya kilomita 16 alafu ikaunganishwa na section ya kilomita 8. Imepigwa mara mbili na magari yamerudi hapa service. Sasa hivi yanafanywa service kila dereva anajaribu kuona kile ambacho atakachoweza uh, kubadilisha kama gari yake na itilafu ya hapa na pale. Lakini kubwa kabisa ni kwamba wanajiandaa kwenda katika stage nyingine uh, ambapo itakuwa ni stage ya nne na ya tano. Utakwenda utapiga, utarudi, alafu unakwenda unapiga tena. Alafu baadaye tutakuwa na stage nyingine. Kwa sasa tuwasikilize wao wanasemaje baada ya stage hizo mbili uh, walizopiga na kama kuna gari na matatizo yote au vipi? Yote unaipata na racing show. Tuko service park sasa. There's there's a battle going on. I mean we're not too close but we're close enough and you know you want to keep it clean because anything can happen. The car's behaving very well. Um, I'm obviously still learning exactly where the limit is of the car. Um, to see what we can do about that. Um, but yeah, everything is going to plan. We are it but uh, 
Manver is going very well. I'm impressed. So um, we, we've got a fight on our hands. Of course, uh, they're both driving well. I think one of them is ahead of us, the uh, R4, and then uh, Nero is always driving well. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Um, you know, the stages are very technical, so you have to you have to try and drive at a good pace, but still keep it on the road as well. So yeah, that's the aim. There's one of the top cars in our class has fallen out now. So. Now we've already climbed the leaderboard without really even trying, so I think we're going to play that game for the rest of the rally, just be there or thereabouts and uh, wait for other people to make mistakes. The 25 seconds we lost is really too much. We, we can't attack and, and win that back. The class is too competitive. We're going really well. The car feels really good. Uh, we're leading our class. Um, we've got a, a decent lead after three stages. So, um, you know, I'm looking forward to the next uh, lots of stages. This last one now, it was quite rough and there were some dangerous places. So we backed off a little bit. Um, so that, that's our game plan. Wherever, wherever it's a bit uh, dangerous and a bit treacherous, we're going to back off a little bit. And, um, you know, where, where it's fast and flowing, we're going to push really hard. So uh, we got a reasonable lead uh, after the first three stages. So we're really happy. The car's been performing fast. Um, just a routine check going on here and uh, hopefully we'll be ready again shortly. So we're going to maintain pace. Our five is equal first, come on one and our four. So you're an experience. I'm going to try to get to the top five. I'm going to try to get to the top five. I think everyone goes quicker on the second run and you know, it's where you lose it. If you're not committed on the first runs, you tend to lose a lot of time. So you know, we have to just try and keep it clean, keep the car on the road and just be more committed to our notes because our notes are, are good, just need to be committed. Tumemea upande wa pili sasa tunakwenda kuangalia uh, stage nyingine uh, stage ambazo tunakutana nazo katika terreni nyingine uh, bado wako katika uh, mashamba hayo ya York na tuone nini ambacho kitatokea katika stage hii ambayo tunaanza nayo hapa ni ya kilomita ngapi matete ni ya kilomita 20 ile inaitwa York Rico bado tupo kwenye mashamba ya, ya timba competition ni tamu bado gari zipo na bado kuna pressure kubwa anaweza kuona sasa kuna terrain nyingine iko sandi iko loose gravel kidogo kwa hiyo SB3 tofauti na ile ya mwanzo unaweza kuona ah ile kwa ipo kidogo na wet kidogo kini check ile kwa tupo hiyo baanza kwa kitu tena nani imeishia kwenye kwenye miti kule kwenye miti kule umesikia imetolewa gia moja tu afu ngoma imeendelea Hey, ni zito. Ni zito. Ni zito. Competition time kabisa. George huyo akiwa na coin. Uh, kitaalamu ninavyoona hizi gari uh, za R2 kidogo wana wana, wana changamoto fulani hivi. Uh, kwenye loose gravel kama hizi sasa pesa anachi anachelewa kuondoka lakini akishapata ile grip exact vile unaweza kuona hapo front wheel kwa hiyo akinavuta mbele kwa hiyo unaweza kuona ile grip lakini akishashika tu basi anakuwa na speed nzuri Zuri kabisa hapo yupo katika hii stage wanapushi kweli kweli mpaka uh, stage ile ya ya 4 wamemaliza yes 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 uh, tunaweza tukaona peke na kila mwongoza atakiwa uh, ametumia dakika 34 na, na sekunde 20 wakati mwingine atakiwa ametumia dakika 34 na sekunde 51 tofauti ya sekunde 20 na 3 yes tunaweza kuona tofauti ya sekunde 23 na maana Uh, kwa maana hiyo uh, uh, Hagen Feken 
wakati gomzi yeye uh, akiwa ametumia dakika 35 sekunde 18 kwa hiyo unaweza kuona gepu ya ya, ya kwake hapo uh, ni kama sekunde ya moja. yes yes kwa hiyo uh, feken uh, bingwa huyu akiwa na gari kabisa kwa mara ya kwanza baada ya kufanya nao shakedown baada ya kufanya mambo mawili matatu lakini uh, naona wanaongoza katika dhidi ya R5 mbili yani yupo mbele ya R5 mbili katika gari hizi ambazo zinakuwa za 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 kwa hiyo unaweza kuona uh, fight itakuwa tamu na stage ya tano hii tunaizungumzia sasa ambapo tunakuja kuona uh, 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 kitakuja kutokea stage ambayo uh, itarudiwa uh, ita, itarudiwa tena yes itarudiwa ita tena uh, yeah, itarudiwa tena hii stage kwa hiyo uh, unaweza kuona na Leroy Gomes akiwa na Ushla Gomes uh, wanaenda vizuri na wana wanamtafuta kweli kweli uh, Manville unaweza kuona kidogo Manville leo yuko easy kama yuko easy basi amkutana na mbabe wake ambaye kidogo anaanza kumtambia kumbuka igari ni low spray uh, ni R4 kit lakini utofauti wa driver naona umeanza kuonyesha hapa uh, Mimona ameza kukota sekunde kadhaa kutoka kwa Manville na ambacho tumetegemea kwamba labda Manville angeweza kunyokoa hata stage moja lakini mpaka sasa hivi uh, bado anapambana kuhakikisha kwamba ana maintain na anapanda kama kiwezekana. Anaenda vizuri na performance yake nzuri na hata tukiangalia time zake amefanya uh, vizuri sana akiwa nyuma ya Guy Botter. Kanavyan freak hapo Kweli ana push kweli kweli kwa kisha kwamba anawatia pressure uh, gari za mbele anawatia pressure kwenye gari kwa mfano kama Leroy Gomes ambaye yuko naye hapo kwenye fighter head to head na pia Leroy Gomes yuko na Manville na Manville naye alioni hata vumbi la uh, Egan Faken kwa hiyo unaweza kuona uh, competition iko iko tight kiasi gani baada ya section 4 tu tayari mtu kapiga nusu dakika Stage ni ya tano hii. Yes. Stage ni ya tano. Uh, Mbaya itapigwa mara mbili, alafu tunapigwa mara mbili. Tunakwenda pale town pale, eh, tunapiga tunenda, super special stage. Eh, tunaenda Sabi pale, Sabi town. 1 eh. and 2 kama kilomita moja pointi uh, mbili tisa. Kwa hiyo unaweza kuona kama uja game time hapa basi ujue pale uweze kupanda kupata chochoto kwa sababu ni kilomita moja tu pointi mbili tisa umempiga umempiga mtu basi sekunde moja au mbili which is ambayo kwa mtu ambaye amepigwa dakika 27 basi ni ni changamoto lakini all in all kwamba bado the keep is steady na tunaweza kuona bado performance maona Leroy Gomes hizo line anazochukua chukua line vizuri yani ametumia pia kwenye flank finish hapo Uh, unaweza kuona amemaliza vizuri ya yeah. Egan Faken naye uh, yuko nyuma naye anakwenda uh, tuone naye anamalizaje ah uh, hii gari bana iko on fire on fire uh, kwa mfano kama hichi ndio kipimo kwamba hii gari na ubora <laughs> basi nafikiri waanze kuiko sida aingia kwenye pipe finish kwenye beam pale 
Acha tuendelee kuona je itatoboa mpaka mwisho maana sio kwa mapigo haya. Eh inaweza hiyo hiyo take off yake kwa sababu uh, unaweza kuangalia ya tu ile ile rhythm yake na time ambayo anaongoza unaweza sasa ukapata uh, ukapata picha. Kwa hiyo uh, tuone katika mzunguko yeah. utakorudiwa. Yeah, na mwenyewe anasema kwamba bado hana confidence yani bado anaangalia anazidi kuisoma gari sasa kama anazidi kuisoma alafu bana okota uh, stage times Chris Koitze mzee technical unaona kuja maximum kulikweli anaelekea kwenye prime finish Yes unaona Mazda Mazda 2 hiyo nzuri sana mm, Mazda R2 Mazda 2 unaona iko vizuri anazidi ku push na nafikiri na enjoy kitu kweli maana fly up on the flight ah gari zinafunguka ah gari zinafunguka jj pods gawe mm ko vizuri akiwa na tommy na vile kuna miti mingi kwa hiyo gari unaweza kuwa unaisikia kama nikwambia alafu uko unafikiri kuna gari nyingine kuna gari nyingine lakini ni same same car ni gari hiyo hiyo inazunguka tu kwenye miti hapo kwenye miti hapo ni, ni msitu wa miti huo wakati inazunguka shamba la miti bado mlio umebaki nyuma yes ni burudani ina yake kwa kweli unaona mpiga wide hapo bado nafikiri guy bote bado ana pressure kuhakikisha kwamba anatunza heshima yake lakini uh, kwa group category yake mpaka sasa hivi yeye ndo anaongoza uh, katika hizi R2 stages au ni wakina Van Wick Cowboys hao yes yes uh, kwa na Ford hiyo Ford bwana imepigwa mm, Ford R2 imepigwa mapigo mbalimbali of course ana fly finish anamaliza stage hiyo hapo unajua ile subaru ime ime, ime nani bwana ime roll ile ile ile, uh, ile, ile nyupe, nyupe. Uh, atumbia kwenye ile stage ya kule Ah kwenye stage ya nne yeah. kabla ya stage ya hii ile stage hii. Okay 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 ndio maana sijaiona hapa. Mm. Ya. Yeah. Natupenyezea kwamba imeanguka. Ime, 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 ime basi naona the crew there okay basi ni ni wacha tuendelee kuona itakuwa imebakia subaru moja tu uh, ile ya ile ya njano ya Luna. Naona naye bado anaenda kupambana. Naam, Ismail Shamu amejakiwa kwenye flying finish na hiyo. Mm, unaweza kuona hapo. Yes, Luna akiwa na intend. Kwa maana Luna alikuwa yuko nyuma ile Subaru nyeupe. Yes, alikuwa nyuma. Naona yeye ndo ametokea basi ujue kwamba kuna tatizo katika gari ambayo ilikuwa imemfuata. Yupo kwenye pesi nzuri, uh, anaweza kuona na kwenda kulingana na pesi yake. Tumaliza sasa na hizo eh, tunamalizia uh, na Crask Dasan SS alafu eh. tumekuja kurudia tena uh, hii stage. Ya yeah, kabisa stage ya tano. Uh, yeah. Etienne yeah. huyu akiwa na Raj wako vizuri kwa kweli wanazidi ku maintain wapo katika competition yao ya watu wa Crask. Unaweza kuona tu wili inapopigwa eh. Inatupwa inatupwa <laughs> na inatupika kwa kweli yani. Eh ni vitu mbalimbali. Anamalizia prime finish hapo. na sikio na Joan yu naye kumbuka unaangalia ARC2 kutoka nchini Afrika ya Kusini uh, tuko mpoma langu huko katika mji wa Sabi uh, yes. katika mashamba haya ya ambao yajulikana kama York uh, York Timber uh, tunaweza kuangalia competition uh, ambayo inasimamia tuko nazungumzia pale mwanzo kwamba Safety South Africa 
uh, ipo juu na kama unavyojua wenzetu wametuzidi yes, uh, yes, yes. wao sasa hivi pamoja na kwamba competition yao imeshuka lakini masuala mengine umetuzidi ya yeah, katika na kufanya maandalizi ya kuandaa na mambo kama hayo unaweza kuona tunaendelea tumerudi tena katika <laughs> eh, sasa naona Manville ni stage ya sita amepagawa naona ameamua ameamua kupush ameamua kupush na nafikiri kuna mandhari mazuri kabisa ya hizi yes, stage yes yes unajua hii section wameshaipita kwa hiyo sasa uh, kinachofuata hapa sasa hivi kama kureki ushareki eh, kinachofuata sasa hivi ni kupush kwa hiyo unaweza kuona kwa hiyo unaweza unaweza kupata picha uh, ya kitu gani ambacho unakifanya uh, sasa yes ni nataka kukaa sasa ya 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 kama kilomita moja hivi ambayo Uh, uwezi kusema tu pale uh, uta uta uta, uta mchaka mweza uwezi uwezi wametoka kwenye ile ya kilomita 20 hii ni kilomita 24 uh, kwa hiyo unaweza kuona jinsi gani alafu alishaipita hii kwa hiyo uh, tumechofuata hapa ni kupiga your best time kwa kitu kinavyoitika huko hatari hatari sana Uh, again fake naona na mission moja tu kuhakikisha kwamba wameleta heshima ya wasanzu Afrika kwa sababu wameshaokotwa sana na manvili hapa karibia misimu miwili mitatu hivi. Mimi ambaye nachukua na kwenda South Africa pale anachukua namba moja eh anachukua namba moja sasa manvili anataka kuchukua hat trick. Sasa naona sasa sijui kama kitawezekana wameka wameka mkakati wanasema wameka mkakati kwamba haiwezekani technical strategy ambazo to make sure kwamba hakuna uh, kitakachotokea kwamba hiyo R4 ndio backup kubwa ya to make sure uh, his R5 tunaweza lakini malegend walikuwa wamepumzika tunaweza tumeamua kumwamsha mmoja tu aje ya kuonyesha jinsi gani sisi tunaposhika gari katika hizo stages za timbers Ah yo kuari timbers. Hebu tuwapewe tazamaji mlio kidogo.
hiki ya gari zinavyoshikiliwa haya niweza kuona VW na Toyota Yaris uh, ikiwa imeshikiliwa vizuri unaweza kuona jinsi gani uh, kila dereva sasa hivi anajaribu ku catch up na time to make sure uh, hatuki mbali au hawachani mbali ile gap ya yes. day one inakuwa kidogo ina, 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 ina uwafadhali kuliko vile ambavyo uh, unatoka hapa mtu ana gap ya karibu uh, dakika mbili kwa hiyo kuna nani kubwa sana kuna 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 kasi kuna pressure kubwa sana kwamba kila mtu ana kwanza lazima ubiti your best time yako ambao umepiga na kingine pia lazima uhakikishe kwamba unapata time nzuri kama mtu wa mbele yako yuko karibu basi hakikisha kwamba una una unampiga una au unapiga time yake ni kama unaweza kuona uh, again faking katika uh, ile time ya mwanzo kabisa alitumia dakika moja na sekunde 21 Uh, lakini hapa sasa hivi katika hii section uh, time yake imeshaingia hapa ametumia dakika kumi na sekunde 24 ina maana amekuwa fast zaidi karibia dakika kutoka kwenye section ya mwanzo kwa hiyo inaonyesha jinsi gani kabisa kwamba alikuwa anaenda ana, kama alivyosema kwamba anacheki gari aone inakuwaaje lakini sasa hii loop ya pili ameamua kuwa kichaa ameamua kukimbia oh, wow. Man vile na hivyo hivyo naona kweli uh, ana push kweli kweli na tukiangalia time yake time yake katika stage hii ya kilomita 24 alikuwa uh, na dakika 11 na sekunde 20. Kwa sasa hivi naona kidogo ameenda vizuri na yeye amezidi kukaza. Yaani muda unavyozidi kwenda na ndivyo competition inavyozidi kuwa uh, kuwa ngumu au kuwa nzuri zaidi. Yes. Yaani ushindani unazidi kuwa mkali. Uh, kila dereva unaweza kumuona Manvili yuko under pressure. Uh, anataka ku catch up ili apunguze gap ya seconds ambazo uh, ameshachapo mpaka dakika hii lakini unaweza kuona tupa vizuri kabisa hapa. Na unajua Manvili ana kila sababu kwa sababu Alivigeta uh, manchezana naye kashacheza na huyu mwaka wa tatu sasa. Yes, yuko naye. Yuko naye. Kwa hiyo unaweza kuona wana ridhi mzuri na wamesha kuja hapa sabi karibia mara tatu kama sikosei ni mara tatu sasa. Yes, 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 yes. Kwa hiyo Na, again faken. kweli wana push kweli kweli kuhakikisha kwamba uh, wanapata best time katika hii kuhakikisha kwamba anakisha na ana, anachukua hii stage tena kama alisichukua katika hizo stage nne ambazo zimepita wacha tuende kuona time yake mpaka mwisho ita, itafikaje lakini uh, ni kubwa kutoka kwenye uh, uh, group hizi za R2 pia kutoka kwa Guy Bottery akiwa pamoja na JJ uh, wengine Chris Kwaitze uh, Jono uh, Van Wyk na, 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 na wengine lakini uh, all in all kwamba okay sasa hivi tunaenda kwenye uh, super special lakini lazima waipige hii kuona jinsi gani uh, wana perform Gari zinashikiliwa yani unaona kabisa gari inavyoshikiliwa inavuvutwa uh, na ukaangalia mandhari sasa hivi msitu ulivyokuwa Uh, mashabiki wa chacho wanaweza kujitokeza uh, katika maeneo muhimu. Yeah, unaweza kuona kabisa watu wameji wamejikategoria. Kamera unaweza kuona hapo jinsi zipo sehemu zote lakini hamna uh, hamna spectators ambao wako lose lose. Wote wapo kwenye tape kama unaweza kuona. Kwa jinsi gani uh, swala la safety wamelizingatia na jinsi gani kuona kwamba uh, spectators nao wana obey au wanashirikiana vyema na waandaaji wa mashindano kuhakikisha kwamba uh, wanafanya haya mchezo huu wa rwari unakuwa salama Unasema mambo yanazidi kuwa moto fire eh toka moja kwa moja Afrika ya Kusini Uh, racing show na kata anga na tunaleta kile ambacho uh, wewe kama mshabiki wa mchezo huu ambao magari unapenda kukiona au unatamani kukiona na ndio hivyo ambavyo unaweza kuona uh, unaweza kumuona mwanadada huyo Luna uh, akipambana 
Kama yes. anapambana na wanaume yeah. uh, na unaweza kuona shughuli yake Subaru pekee ilobakia katika yeah. katika katika competition uh, zilizobaki zote ni R2 ma VW ma, ma, ma Ford uh, zile zile Ford Fiesta iko moja hapo hapo ambao ni, ni R2 na hizo classic car kwa hiyo uh, hawezi kukubali aje kuchapwa na classic car lazima akanyage au nyeshe kwamba anaye yuko kwenye kupambana uh, ah, mambo ya tuli ya <laughs> unaitupa side to side naam ni burudani kabisa yani ya, ni, ni, ni vitu kama hivi ambavyo vyote unaweza kuzipata hapa katika Uh, tupo katika msitu wa Sabi Mpumalanga hapa tunaangalia live kabisa ARC uh, round ya pili ya Afrika hapa na sasa hivi tunaweza kuona gari zimeshapita nyingi na sasa hivi tunamalizia hizi gari za classic alafu baadaye tutaona kuona uh, special stage ambayo itafanyika pale uh, Sabi town lakini all in all ni kwamba uh, watu wana push performance ni nzuri sana ya yeah, performance ni nzuri sana na uh, mambo yanaenda vizuri na unaweza kuona moments kama hizo zipo ala tu competition ni kubwa sana hey, mambo yanazidi kuwa moto unasema mambo ni fire katika mji wa Sabi R5 Manvid Bariana akiwa na Drew Star tunaweza kuona uh, nani ya msitu huo akijaribu ku uh, kupambana aweze kukava sekunde ambazo amesha chapwa na inavonekana ali overshoot mwanzoni kule ali ile mcost ku kuanza ku, uh, kutafuta hizo sekunde kuja kukava yes nimeona alipoteza kaka ile na section ya mwanzo waya kwa hiyo sasa hivi naona anajaribu ku recover naona anaweza kuanza kuona ana push kulikweli anasimamisha vumbi kulikweli lakini Liloi naye naona naye anakuja na keep win sana wacha tuende kuona lakini anajitahidi ya yeah, anajitahidi kikweli anajitahidi na kuna makosa hapa na pale lakini uh, anaendelea vizuri kwa sababu kama hii ni rally yake ya tatu na hii gari basi uh, lazima tuompe respect yake maliza hapo yes lakini ye yeah. ataendelea kuongoza ndani ya stage hii tunajaribu kuona nini ambacho uh, atatupa matokeo gani yes wacha tuendelee kuona je yeah. ataendelea kuongoza Je, yeah, atakuwa amepigwa na Leroy au amepigwa na Manville? Ama Manville amejaribu kupambana kuona jinsi gani kwamba anaweza ameweza kukava time. Yes, yes, yes. Tutaona uh, kwa time kwa time hapo za kuangalia na kusikia uh, milio ya engine uh, ya, ya magari tofauti tofauti na unapata picha uh, kama kwenye NRC yetu pale Tanzania uh, gari hizi zinashuka kama mbili mbili tu zinje kutupa joto kwa hiyo zinje kutubadilisha mm. tumeshazoea milio mbalimbali ya boxer ya ya Evo eh zije kuleta ujoto ujoto kidogo hapo. Eh zije kuonyesha kwamba jinsi gani tuone uh, gari kama hizi zinaweza zikashikwa katika low spec. Unaweza kuwa na gari ya kama hiyo lakini pia ukafanya vizuri na ukaenjoy rally yako na hata ukachukua uh, kikombe lakini 
uh, tunaweza kuona vitu kama hivi ndio tunavihitaji tunajaribu kuona okay arafo imekuja hapo wacha tuone labda kuna watu wataweka mzigo mm. uh, wezi jua eh, wezi jua sabu kwa sababu ndio imekuja na wanasema kwamba gharama zake zitakuwa ni nafuu nafuu zaidi kwa sababu manufacture itakuwa ni Afrika mm. uh, na na spares zitakuwa zikipatikana kwa urahisi yeah. uh, kwa hiyo tuone nini ambacho uh, kita kita kitajiri katika siku za usoni yeah. uh, lakini kwa sasa tuangalie je yeah. itatoboa itamaliza <laughs> itamaliza hicho ndio kikubwa hicho uh, ndio ambacho uh, tunaangalia ame, amepewa driver mzuri professional driver tuone je yeah atatupa feedback yani kwamba gari ni ni ni, ni aje ina uwezo au ni takataka au ni mzigo kwa hiyo acha tuone lakini uh, Hyundai ya kwanza i20 inaanza kutengenezwa sasa hivi South Africa hapa na bila shaka itakuwa tayari kabla ya msimu huu kwa hiyo uh, tunakuwa tunarali tuna gari zetu wenyewe kutoka South Africa unaweza kuona hiyo yote kajibu kukupa wewe burudani uh, lakini pia nafikiri, nafikiri pia Uh, inawezekana ikawa nafasi kama Kenya watapata nafasi ya uh, uh, ya kufanya WRC 2020 uh, inaweza kana kuna maderevu watakuja kutoka Europe na watakuwa wanahitaji magari ya kutumia of course of course na kuja kuna gari mpaka huku wengine watakuwa ni shida lakini mtu anafika huku anakuja kuhaya kaa ya yeah, kabisa kabisa kwa privateer kuja kutoa gari uh, kutoka Ulaya mpaka hapa basi ni changamoto lakini anaweza akasogeza aka gari ambayo ipo za South Africa, ipo gari ipo Tanzania, ipo gari ipo somewhere hapo basi inakuwa rahisi zaidi ya. Kwa hiyo unaweza kuona kwa hizi gari lazima ziwe tayari. Kwa lazima utatengeneza gari mbili tatu uh, ili kama dereva anakuja anataka uh, kuhaya basi anaweka mzigo mezani analetewa gari na service crew anapewa kabisa unapewa kabisa mna kalkulate wewe unakuja na navigata wako tu wewe na navigata yako na rally suit yako mm. kila kitu unapata hapa kila kitu unapata hapa hapa kwa hiyo ndio 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 unaona ame special amepiga heavy landing pale <laughs> hamsi si zani kama ziko salama acha tuone tunaweza kuona Siyan. kwenye time kwenye time bado ni pagumu kidogo uh, sasa hivi zimeongezeka sekunde zimekuwa ishina saba kamuongezea tena mm. homework maana mimi naita homework, homework amemuongezea ame manvili homework kwa sababu bwana tunaenda special stage ukirudi kesho hebu amecheza 10 16 mwenzake amecheza kwa 10:20 yani kuna sekunde nne eh, za ziada kwa kuja kiongeza eh, na zile 23 unapata 27 saba kwa manvili anatakiwa kukava sekunde 27 wakati Leroy Gomes ana dakika moja na sekunde 32 hapa tunamuondoa huyu tunamuondoa katika hii competition mm, kuna unless competition. otherwise kuna uh, ipate breakdown. breakdown ipate DNF hapo katikati lakini uh, mpaka sasa hivi basi a uh, 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 Feken Hagen Feken yuko uh, vizuri na anaendelea vizuri na anazidi ku extend lead yake kutokana kwa kutoka kwa Manville uh, na yeye akiwa na Pierre Arias huyu naye pia amecheza naye sana katika uh, championship huko nyuma 2008 2009 kwa hiyo uh, uwezo wao hauna shaka pass shaka ndio maana amepewa yeye kwamba bwana hebu tuonyeshe hii gari inashikwaje hii R4 hebu aonyeshe kwamba okay tutataka tutengeneze hapa hebu waambie kwanza hii gari inakwaje kwa hiyo unaweza kuona uh, ni performance nzuri ambayo uh, a, 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 anaifanya kwa so far unaweza kuona mpaka sasa ametumia muda wa dakika 55 na sekunde 8 uh, Egan Fekin akifuatiwa na Manvili ambaye ametumia dakika 55 na sekunde 36 na Gomes akiwa ametumia dakika 56 na sekunde 40 wakati Guy Botwell akiwa ametumia dakika 57 na sekunde 20. Na mzamaji racing show baada ya kuangalia zile stage 6 sasa tuko katika stage ya 7 ambayo iko Sabi Town hapa. Tutaangalia super special stage hii ambapo uh, madriver wote ambao uh, mpaka sasa hivi wapo gari 15 tutaziona zikicheza katika stage hii. Manvili Barian bado ana kazi kubwa kabisa ku cover sekunde 27 na, na ndio gari ya kwanza atakayoingia katika super special hii kwa captain Mike Maleo tumeweza kusikia kuona madreva wakiwa katika hali yao ya utulivu na mambo mengine sasa tunaoja kuona hapa nini ambacho kitatokea it's all time super special stage eh giza limeshatanda sasa eh, na hapo sio kwamba ni usiku sana ni saa 12 tu eh, ni saa 12 hiyo 
uh, kwa sasa huku unaweza kaona kwamba uh, kuna visa la kutosha Mandy Mariani na Drew Star. Yes. This stage iko very trick. Very tricky. Unafanya mchezo um, uh, unarudi ulipotoka. Eh, ukifanya <laughs> mchezo tu um, umeharibu time yako. Na unaanza kuona ni uh, 1.59 km zitapigwa mara mbili. Kwa hiyo itakuwa uh, hiyo sub town 1 and 2. Kwa hiyo ni itakuwa ni section ya 6 na ya 7. Kwa hiyo unaweza kuona ni jinsi gani Tuangalie, tuwape tuone. Tuwape ndani. yake nyingine ya mwisho hiyo namaliza round ya mwisho hiyo Kiangalia naona kama haipushi vizuri naona na, na nafikiri ameshaona kwamba gap ya sekunde 27 sio race to cover katika na. katika hii na hapo uweze kufanya chochote katika hiyo uh, circuit ya 1.5 kilomita kumbuka kwamba kuna kagiza tayari unatumia light tu na ziko very very trick kicho pia ni siku nafikiri is brave kwamba ataki kufanya vimbwanga vyovyote hapo unaweza kufanya chochote karibu kila kitu kwa na kumaliza naam yeye amekushamaliza tuone sasa gari linofuata leo gomes akiwa na ushio gomes Na unaweza ukaona 
Uh, Manvira ametumia dakika mbili na sekunde 40 nukta moja uh, katika stage hiyo na tunaweza kuona hapa time ya uh, Liwe Gomes ni dakika mbili na sekunde 40 nukta nne wamepishana nukta wamepishana nukta nukta sasa tuone fake na anatumia muda gani wacha tuone Cheza vila ambavyo. Hali ni giza kidogo. Ya, yeah, bado, bado kuna vitu tofauti. Na kingine mm. pia kumbuka terain tofauti. Uh, una, una tile za kwa hapa. Una cheza kwa matama. Hapo mzee unatua mzigo na eka mzigo. Yani, wamebadilisha tile ya. Hawa, oh, wamebita service. Ya. Uh, wamengia service. Kwa sasa na mana lazima kama dereva una, una, una shusha mzigo amemaliza uh, feken tuone time yake feken time yake ni dakika mbili na sekunde 30 Hi Botteri, people on stage. Watch out one. Uh, we are going to see how much on fire. Ah, na tupa. Kina e muliwa ke ule ulivo. Eh? <laughs> Lightweight ko yo. Uh, me balance vizuri na gari. Kirivas hii 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 ndio inampotezea. Mm. Akipale alikuwa anatakiwa anakuja na zote na anajaza na tap kidogo. Mm. 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 Ina geuka unaendelea sasa. Mm. Poteza sekunde mbili tatu pale. Ya yeah, kwenye Rivers. Ya, yeah, naona mm. ana, ana rivi mzuri, anaenda ni kama stage, nani ni kama circuit ambayo anaijua. Yaani tofauti na Manville unaweza kuona lazima itakuwa ilikuwa nightmare kwake. Lazima mm. ilikuwa ni stage moja ambayo imemkera sana kwa sababu huwezi kupigwa <laughs> sekunde kumi hapa. <laughs> Lakini kwa guy bottle naona ni kama ana, anaenda kwa hisia, anaenda vizuri sana. Wacha tuone time yake mpaka mwisho.
Aliza. Aliza na kuna zake service park. Tutaona time yake mpaka hapo. Na tunaweza kuona guy Botoril akiwa na Vasili ametumia dakika mbili na sekunde 40. Kwa hiyo unaweza kuona pale aliporudi Rivers. Ya, dakika mbili na sekunde 40. Kwa hiyo naye ni tofauti ya sekunde kumi dhidi ya ya Feken. Ya, kwa hiyo amemzidi pia kwa milisekondi moja nukta moja Manvil Bariani. Kwa hiyo yuko juu ya Manvil Bariani. Yes. Kwa hiyo amefanya best time kuliko Leroy ama Leroy tayari. Leroy tayari, Leroy naye ame nani? Ame amecheza dakika mbili sekunde 40 amepisha nukta tatu nukta moja. Ya, okay okay okay. Sawa ni kweli. Kwa hiyo wako hapo tu lakini nafikiri yeye ndo ah baada ya feke ni amefuata yeye. Ah jamaa bwana mimi na usiku sana. Ah wakina wakina Van Wick. Ah. John Van Wick akiwa na Barry White. Fiesta ara tu jinsi anavyokwenda sioni kama yani unaweza kashangaa anamchapa ana, ana hata feken naona ana, yani kwa yuko kwa kwenye rhythm nzuri kwa pesi nzuri naona na moko ndoka na mapipa swaz nini swaz cowboys swaz cowboys wala wala stage ile wao wanataka kuiokota hiyo wana push kweli kweli unaweza tuone time yao mpaka mwisho itakuwaaje lakini Maliza na Swaz Cowboys hao One Wink wakiwa metumia dakika mbili na sekunde thelathini na nane Yes Kwa hiyo unaza wakuta sasa hivi Ukiangalia kwa waleo cheza, inamana ye yuko juu na fasi ya pili. Na fasi ya pili badala ya feken. Badala ya feken, sabu amepishana point sekunde nani. Yes, amepiga sekunde mili Guy Botteri. Kwa moja na Manville. Kwa moja na Manville, ya. Kwa wame cheza vizuri. Yes, cheza vizuri. Na umona amefanya best time. Kwa very fast, unona ni mtu ambaye mwenye malengo ya kukota hii stage. Shapotea tawa. Huyu amesha potea. Sema amesha. Wanasema ukisha potea. Kuliza kicho usichanganyikio kapotea za hii. Kuliza konstitution kabisa. kupotea kabisa amekwenda alitaka kwenda kwenye flying finish kwenye flying finish kule wamemwambia e, sasa alikuwa siku anaingia kwenye flying make <laughs> unatakiwa eh yani ile flying finish <laughs> yeye alikuwa anapita kwa nyuma eh <laughs> lose kabisa concentration yes yes kwa hiyo ile confidence yote naona imepotea sasa hapo ndo
na msomaji wa racing show hii ndio super special stage na tumaini umeweza kuona kile ambacho uh, kimeendelea katika uh, town hii ya Sabi hapo naitwa Sabi town ambapo katika parking hizi uh, za madaladala sijui na nini tumeweza kuona kile ambacho kimechezwa hapa bado wengine wanaendelea kucheza uh, katika stage hii mimi nataka sasa tukazungumze na madereva uh, ambao wako service park sasa hivi pale ili tuweze kujua hali ya magari yao iko vipi na kesho wanamka vipi hiyo ni gari nyingine ambayo iko ndani uh, ya stage kwa sasa mimi mmoja kwanza tunaangalia kidogo hapa afu tutakutana tena stage ili kuweza kusikiliza pale service park hizi kuweza kusikiliza madereva wanatuambia nini shughuli ni nzito kweli kweli hapa mambo kama hivyo Hii kona inaonekana inawashinda watu wengi sana. Eh, hey, niona kama inawa surprise mm. lakini kama wame kama wamereki na ipo kwenye notes inabidi andikwe na votakiwa kusudi ujue. Naona isma isma shema mimi nimeshapotea. Shapotea. Naona anaenda kama ameshapotea kwa sababu kama notes hawana hivi. Ni sema ambayo kidogo mm. kona imekuwa kwa tu labda akufanya reki nzuri kwa eh, hiyo so wameamua tu kwamba twende tukacheze tu mm au ni ile kwamba asitumechezaga kila siku. Unaweza kuona anaenda vile kama mpaka akiona njia ndo anabonyeza. Mm. No, yani Unaweza kuona hata kwenye kona hizo tani dogo zinakuwa zinampa changamoto. Mshinda mm. tena. Si vipi? au stelling yana na inawezekana kuna tatizo au au power stelling inawezekana kuna tatizo maana sio kawaida mara yeah. mbili alafu yeah. kama gari na mm. kama clutch labda ina, inazingua hivi ya yeah, inawezekana ikawa mm. inawezekana yeah. kuna tatizo ya yeah. clutch hmm. au power stelling pia inawezekana kwa gari ya cut maliza ismaisha mohamed mm. tuangalie time yake um, Ah, amekuwa mbali sana dakika 3 sekunde 17 pretty good day um i think we won all seven stages or in any case we we tied one but uh car is going very well um everything is going according to plan so we must just keep it together tomorrow yeah look um manver made a little error in the first stage so we took 20 of the we are 28 ahead now so uh, we took 20 of those in the first stage and uh, since then we took one or two half a second point one of a second at one stage so still a close dice but uh yeah we um we must just keep pushing so that he doesn't take any time back um no of course it was was a good day um we were driving at good pace um we didn't take too many risks and we're actually happy where we are at the moment because um last year we You know we hit uh, not in this one the, the one in Nelspit but uh, we hit the, one of the curbs and we damaged the wheel and some things so we didn't really want to take any risks it's been a tough day hey we started very well came off the pace got tired during the course of the day bowed down to the champ you know it's like okay we we have a long way to go to to match the pace but look we had a good good day kept it clean kept it on the road um it was tough you know so now we we sit in third overall and and just hoping that we can manage that and just you know go for third because it's the guys in front of us are just um they drivers you know 
they, they drive very well. You know, being fourth overall is not, uh, not a bad thing uh, behind the four-wheel drive cars. So we're quite happy with today's performance. Um, we're just going to try and keep it clean tomorrow. Um, you know, tomorrow's stages are preferred to today's stages. So uh, yeah, we're looking forward to the stages tomorrow. I like them and uh, just try and keep the momentum forward for tomorrow. You're going to do the mapping when you throw to back and clutch. You throw to the car on a set of the cupboard when you conduct it. Uh, I am going to clutch at the same time. Yeah, super special stage. I am going to go to the stage. I am going to go to the stage. I am going to the stage. I am going to go to the stage. I am to Strategy for tomorrow is uh, look, we're not far enough yet to relax, so we um, we're gonna keep doing what we did today. Just go flat, go flat out, yeah. <laughs> Nam, we call it a day. Ni siku ilikuwa ni ndefu kwa likweli. Tuko na stage saba kwa siku ya leo na stage ya mwisho ndo kama hiyo ambayo imemalizika hapo katika town ya Sabi na tumerudi hapa service park kwa jili ya kuzungumza na madereva na tumweza kusikia kila ambacho madereva wamekizungumza hapa uh, kila mmoja technical fault ambayo ameweza kuipata ameweza kufix uh, na tayari gari nyingine zinaondoka kuelekea park fame kwa ajili ya siku ya kesho ilikuwa ni siku ndefu sana na tukiweza kushuhudia kwamba uh, Feken anaongoza anaongoza kwa dakika 57 sekunde 39 akiwa amemchapa Manvir Bariani kwa sekunde uh, 37 akifuatiwa Manvir ambaye yupo nyuma na nafasi ya tatu akiwa amechukua uh, Rue Gomes nafasi ya nne uh, imekwenda kwa Guy Botterell na nafasi uh, ya tano ikiwa uh, imekwenda kwa Van Wick ni shughuli pevu kesho au day 2 kuna siku nyingine ngumu zaidi yote hii unaipata ndani ya Racing Show mimi naitwa Captain Mike Malue kutoka katika Service Park hapa uh, maeneo ya Sabi kumpumalanga <laughs> ni hatari tu poza kuona magari yako service hapa yanamalizika magari mengine tayari ameshaondoka kwenda park fame na sisi wacha tukapumzike ni siku ndefu kweli kweli ciao